And hello there, this is Isix with another episode of Minecraft on the Banana Viking server. We're here once again at our little, uh, our little base here, our little home, our place where I've been doing a bit of mining. That's why we're only doing two episodes this week. Um, so I got some stuff, I'm also getting, arranging some, uh, some books. I've been uh, doing a little bit of uh, fishing as well as uh, at the um, at the, at spawn, as well as uh, doing some other enchanting. I might use my own experience to uh, start building up some some items here. Um, also, been doing a lot of mining as I mentioned, so I got a fair bit of um, random crap here. Also, more iron. Isn't it ironic? Ha <laughs> ha Just gonna move the coal up here. Here we go. You might notice all my stones gone missing because that's moved up there. To do, don't remember if I did that last time or not. <clears throat> I just had dinner, so if I'm a little more burpy or something like that than usual, well, you're probably used to it by now, actually. <laughs> um, so, uh, as I said before, we got our uh, stuff up here. And I think today I'm going to uh, start uh, some of the early design work on the uh, actual like stuff I'm building, like actually building stuff. Holy smokes, guys! It's gonna be, it's gonna be crazy. But I think I'm going to do a special thing involving some iron, because I do got my pickaxe here, but it's a, uh, a fortune and efficiency on breaking craziness. We're not going to be using that much today. Um, instead, we're going to be do making a iron pickaxe, a utility pickaxe, in case we need to, like, pick something, you know? Yes. Pick something like my nose. No, we're not gonna pick my nose. At least I don't think I'm going to. Are we gonna pick my nose? I don't think I'm going to. At least not today. Ha 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 ha. Anyway, so uh, as we said before, we were sort of planning out our uh, our basic situation over here. So I would like to get some uh, some blocks of various sorts. So we got some uh, some granite. We got some cobblestone. Uh, I'm not going to cook up all my cobblestone because I do want to have some options for uh, possible stuff there. We're going to have our smooth stone. Uh, maybe, yeah, we'll, we'll do a couple here. Uh, we're also going to get our andesite and our diorite. Let's die right. And for these, we're going to pop out half a stack each. Da -da -da. Like so. And uh, the smooth stone will just turn into bricks. And, uh, don't need these. Just getting rid of some charm and stuff I didn't want. Not super useful. Just a couple levels each, so. Should be should be alright to not have that. Alrighty, alrighty. So, uh, let's organize our stuff a little bit more here. Um, so, I guess the first thing is, this uh, marker here is going to be the inner walls. So, uh, we can sort of start... Doing a little bit of that sort of stuff here. Um, and then we'll uh, worry about buttresses and things like that afterwards. Ho ha. And uh, I guess another thing is, do I want to get rid of the, uh, the, the the dirt here? I am leaning towards yes. I think I'm going to uh, uh, do a couple things like that. Yes. So it looks like it's coming right down into the world here yes um and that's another reason to have uh, some of these this uh, smooth stone around you could do stuff like that yeah uh-huh actually um dirt can also be used like a so we don't want to waste all our stuff on it all right and uh get the smooth stone back there we go so it all kind of blends together pretty well Excellent. And, uh, just keep going like that. All right, it is getting dark. We're going to have to go inside for a moment. For just a moment. I just kind of wanted to uh, start getting a feel of what the situation is going to be like. Oh-ha. Anyway, uh, as I said, I've been uh, mostly working on uh, collecting resources the last few days. <coughs> uh, folks have been on and off the uh, server of various sorts. Uh, we got some of uh, the... Uh, the do another portal uh, adventure uh, sorted out at uh, spawn now. Uh, don't did I show that off last time? I might have. Yes, I did. I'm pretty sure I did. Um, I think Gibbon's also been building something over there. Um, at least 
that was the plan. Um, I'm going to sleep. Yes. Hmm. Anyway. <laughs> I'm sleeping. Also, I forgot to get extra water before uh, starting to record. I'm going to run out here soon. I'm going to have to pause to go take care of that. Hmm. Oh, well. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to get a uh, little bit of this wall started here. I hear zombies. But that should be totally, totally uh, sensible, given that they are pretty much right on the other side of this dirt here. <laughs> All right, uh, it's more of this uh, dirt I need to deal with. Yes, yes, moan all you like. It will not save you, Mr. Zombles. All right, uh, I think generally going like this here would be a good idea. All right, so that'll, uh, that'll look nice and natural. All right. And uh, this one on the corner here is as far as we need to go with this stuff, because uh, we'll have other stuff going on to cover up this corner. Uh, yeah, just sort of uh, keep doing it here. Keep doing it. Oh ha <clears throat> Alright, and uh, we'll do a couple more levels here. We'll also uh, make good use of the rest of this. I don't necessarily need the smooth stone at the moment. Unless we got more right over the right over there. Alright, alright, so that's looking looking pretty decent so far. Now, uh, what we're going to be doing over here is anybody's guess. It might be a, a tower, it might be something else. I'm still kind of trying to decide here, so. Alright. Cool, cool, cool. And uh, maybe one more, maybe one more. Alright. After this, we're going to collect some dirt, because we might be needing to build some scaffolds. Alright, that, sh that should be good enough. <clears throat> and uh, a little bit more of the smooth stuff. The smooth stuff, yes. The smooth stuff for you and me. Yes, all right. And uh, I'm also dirt, yes. Don't need a ton of it, just enough. All right, um... I don't got a uh, workbench here. I should fix that. Hello, workbench. Are you working for, working it? Yeah. <laughs> All right, uh, I think I'm also going to do a little bit of something like this. Get some of these half slabs. Excellent. Uh, I'm going to do a bunch of these, but not a ton. I'm also going to do a few of these here. Excellent, excellent. All right, so now we got some options for things to fiddle with for our palette. Yes, yes. All right. So I guess the thing I want to do is this is going to be sort of the uh, the prototyping area for the uh, rest of the stuff we're going to be building up. So the question is, what do I want it to look like? How far do I want it to come out? How far, you know, uh, do, you know the the features and various things like that should I be uh, fiddling around with here? And I toss that there. <laughs> Hello, giant crevice of doom. I need to be really careful about. Uh, Possibly falling down here. Hmm. Yes, yes, yes. Shoot at me all you like. If I fall and die down there, I'm going to blame you guys. <laughs> Alright, well, I guess maybe use this entrance as sort of a... Um, this, this big big gap here is sort of the... Framing here might be a good idea. Um, Alright, well, we're going to have something that kind of pops out. Might as well be making it uh, look like it's coming. Uh, we're we're going to have it come out too, I think. Yeah. All right. Um, question is on the other side. Yeah. Do it like this. All right. So this is going to be our our base distance here. All right, that is workable. All right, so uh, this is going to be our buttresses as they go up, but we are going to uh, vary the material a bit. Yes, yes, yes. So 
couple like that. Um, maybe a couple of these. A couple more. And uh, then maybe a different material. Maybe maybe one of these. We'll, we'll, we'll give this a try. And then we'll have a little stair at the top here. Yes, yes, yes. All right. Uh, and then from this point on, we'll uh, we'll figure things out. <laughs> uh, so let's see kind of how that's starting to look as far as the general pattern goes. Um, hmm. I'm not sold on it. Needs more. Needs more texture, I think. Thankfully, we got just the thing. Um, so we got to take that out. What if we did like that? So that way there's a little bit of symmetry going on. It's maybe not quite perfect. Uh, especially if we take this one out as well. Place it with one of those. So just move this up. A little bit. That way we have uh, a little bit more symmetry. Of our curious design. <clears throat> yeah. I think I like that. It's a little strange, but it's there. It's getting there. It's getting there. All right, uh, let's go to the other side, and uh, so we can have a look at them, how they look at at each other in the combinations. All right. Um, so I guess first off, we should uh, put down a piece of dirt so that we can put uh, this right here. Take the dirt away. Then, there we go. And climb back up. Hop, a hip, a hip, a hop, hip hop, a hippin, and then you repeat into the regular beat once more. You know, you know me by now. All right, uh, then it's like that. All right, good, 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 good. Now this is just the the primary struts of the buttress. We are going to make it more expansive than that, of course, of course, of course. So we do want to have some some variance to it. Now, one option would be to do it like this, and then have it be super duper thick, uh, and do it on the other side, of course. But I'm not sure if I'm really sold on that, at least at this angle. Oops. Trying not to waste too many resources. I'm still not super rich on that. I'm just been collecting a bit. But I think uh, maybe, maybe something here might be a good start here. Yes, and we'll have uh, one up top as well. Mm -hmm. And this will actually uh, move into our next bit. Yes. Alright. So the, uh, the trick is what are we going to put between these two? Well, I think one answer is a little bit more of that. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, we could also uh, extend this down a bit. Hmm. Ooh ha. Like so. So a similar pattern to what's up top here. But not quite the same. Not quite the same. Um, hmm. I want to have some something down this way, but not quite match it up perfectly. Uh, maybe just a little something like that will work. Hmm. It's getting kind of complicated, but I'm not not sure if I'm sold on it yet. Hmm. All right, uh, I should probably get some dirt out here so I can do some more climbings. All right, and then on top of this, I don't know. I'm just not, I'm just not feeling this yet. I think I got a um, an alternative approach. 
It's similar, but not quite the same. You see, we're going to time travel. No, we're not going to time travel today. Uh, we're going to, uh, I guess, attempt to mirror what we have here, but just move it up a little bit. That might be a better approach. All right, it's getting dark. Time for another little lap. It will be... Ooh, I'm trapped on here. Oh, no! <laughs> um, but we'll, uh, we'll be on that in the morning. Because we are trying to create a, a particular pattern to it. But I want to make it, make it unique and interesting. To sort of drive our style as we move forward. This is kind of the formative moments of the, of the, of the build, you see. You get started with one sort of pattern, then you repeat a lot of it, and then it starts giving you ideas for new ones, and you evolve from them. You push forward. And you're pushing forward using all your breath. Hmm. Yes. Anyway. <laughs> uh, and uh, this sort of uh, design, the design decisions here will uh, suggest how to proceed for, like, with the round towers, the, the other bits, all sorts of fun stuff. All right, uh, we need you, by the way. Yes, don't fall down too far into the giant void. Oh no, I got a text message. Um, hmm. My sister is apparently at a convention in Cleveland. Good for her. I'll have to uh, message her back later. <laughs> I'm recording that right now. By the way, I have family members. Um, they exist. <laughs> I know I don't talk about uh, much about myself here uh, on the channel, but uh, I do have like people that are existing in my universe. All right. Um, hmm. Oh, this gives me an idea. Kind of. Sort of. Maybe. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I got it. I got it. I got it. Um. Gonna have this guy come out that way. Then. Uh, no, it's not gonna work. Hmm. Or maybe it will be. I'm gonna toss down like a, uh, a fence post there. Maybe I'm making this thing too thin already. Maybe that's my problem. Maybe it should be nice and thick all the way up until like the. Uh, the upper levels here. All right, we'll uh, back off a bit there. Um, start off our usual pattern down from below. All right, and maybe maybe here we'll uh, do that. Yeah, yeah, that might work. Yeah, a little bit more of that action, sort of action. All right. Oh, I think this is going to be much better. All right. Uh, that way we can sort of interlace the patterns a bit. Have that. And then one of these up here. Wow. Yeah, the, the diorite. Yeah. <laughs> the, uh, the whatever this thing is called. Yeah, that one. <laughs> uh, and just a little bit of a uh, stair at the top. All right, and there, we're, from there, we can then do a set back here. All right, I'm not sure if I like this big uh, sort of lower pylon stuff here, but uh, probably should be going this general direction to uh, sort this out. All right, it'll be sort of a banded pattern overall. I'm not sure how I feel about that. Hello, Zombles. How you doing? I really need a bow. <laughs> I really haven't bothered to make one myself. There's plenty of like broken ones in the uh, or half broken ones in the uh, in the the fishing chests and things like that. So I could always repair one of those potentially. Uh huh. And, uh, time for dirt scaffolding. Oh my! And a little bit of that action. And. Uh, just uh, toss ourselves back down to the ground. Oh, 
are getting so late here. Um, right, let's uh, stand off a bit. I really need like a. I should have made a boat so I can just sort of row out to the uh, middle things here. All right, that's that's getting there. It's getting there. I think I have an idea of how to make it even better. To uh, prevent it from looking like it's just random bands of stuff here. All right, so. So now, are you watching this? Hope you're watching this. Come up here. All right. Gonna take this out. Then we're going to replace it with that. Pretty cool, huh? And this one, we're going to replace with that. Awesome, eh? I think I have the item, but I didn't get by not dying. Oh, wrong thing. Note to self, avoid dying. <laughs> Alright, so that's looking a little better. Um, what we're gonna need, it's gonna need, it's gonna need a little bit more, I think. So, uh, let's try this again. A little bit closer this time. Not quite in the right place I wanted to be, but that's fine. Um, so we got that one. Then we're going to take that one out. We're going to make it like that. Yeah. And then we're going to do the same thing over on the next one. Hoo ha. Awesome. Now uh, I need more stairs, so let's go take care of that. <laughs> we're going to have a staring contest one of these days. Uh, that was awful. <laughs> But oh, so good at the same time. All right, um, stairs. Yes. Also, stairs are, I think, more economically uh, viable as far as uh, general building construction goes. So that's pretty cool. Oh, hello, Mr. Sh Mr. Mr. Uh, stone bricks. All right, uh, let's try to hop over there. Excellent. That way we don't have to keep doing the thing. But, uh, we'll actually move one down. Because we need certain angles here. Alright, uh, there we go. There we go. Excellent, excellent. Um, now for this, the middle, I'm not sold on it being the, 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 the stone slabs here. So I think, just maybe, we need a, uh, a little something different. Uh, maybe one of these, maybe one of these. Let's, uh, Look at that there. That looks pretty good. Looks pretty good. Hmm. And uh, it's less speckly than uh, the other option, the uh, the normal andesite, the non-smoothed version, the non-polished version. Though I could also give it a little color. A little bit of a polished granite here. Which is still a little speckly, but... Um, it's pretty good, but I think I'm going to go with the polished andesite, and I'm going to replace this with the granite. Yeah, that might uh, that might be workable. Then that means also for to complete, complete the pattern. There we go. Wow. All right, that's uh, looking a fair bit more interesting. But now there's now there's still that uh, the bandage structure though, which I'm not too fond of. Um, I do like how the uh, the stairs does do kind of curve around with that, that which will uh, provide definite depth to it. <coughs> definite depth. Hmm. Hmm. I think it'll look better when we have the the full might of the uh, the, the what's it here sort of sorted out, which means we should probably get on to that. So um, I guess we'll uh, continue some of this pattern here. We'll just fill that in for now. Don't need to be falling down so much. Uh, what do we want to have behind here? We could have more stairs, of course, um, to sort of really curve it around. We do got them right now. So I might uh, just go ahead and uh, fiddle with that. We'll, we'll need to have something down there. 
which we got something for right here. That doesn't look quite as I want it to, but that's okay. <laughs> all right, uh, do like that. Excellent, all right. All right, now uh, we're going to have the main section of this continue to go up. We should probably have this lower bit not be uh, totally super duper high, but I guess I haven't quite decided how tall I want to make this thing yet. There is multiple options there. And I guess this bit we can also... Yeah, because we are going to have stone behind this. Um, some sort. You get brick or smooth. So yeah, we can do that sort of thing here. Now I think it's important for this bit to actually straight up have just normal stone brick. And, uh, we'll just keep filling this in <laughs> as we go. Uh, important to have stone brick so we uh, avoid the, uh, the banding problem once again. Um, hmm... Maybe even to help break that up a bit, we'll uh, add a little bit extra there. And uh, to help with the color issue, a little bit more there. Complete the pattern. And there you go. It's getting dark again. Zombies are going to try to come out and murder me. Well, how about I take a little pause and uh, we'll uh, come back with the uh, this buttress uh, and that buttress started up. This will not be the top, this will be far from the top, but uh, it'll be um, sort of done in sections and sort of having it look like it's pieces of things kind of click together like that is perfectly acceptable. So I will see you guys in just a moment. Wow. And we're back and uh, sudden reveal. And I just realized I put the wrong block there. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, I went ahead and did another one over there. And uh, I'm realizing I may have uh, inverted some of what I intended to have there. Kind of wanted the uh, stairs on the lower uh, bit of the middle section to actually be the reverse of what they are presently. So I might need to go fix that in a moment here. Yeah, let me know how you guys are thinking about this so far. Are you enjoying? Are you enjoying the style? I'm not. I'm not sure yet if I do. But uh, we're gonna, gonna give it a try, and if everything falls apart, well, we could always rebuild everything from scratch at some point in the future. We'll already have most of the resources. Hooray! <laughs> All right, uh, do that there. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, that looks a little bit better in my view. Sure, it kind of looks like a. Um, it kind of has an X pattern to it, really. Maybe an asterisk. Yeah, it's sort of the central bits kind of coming in. And I also need to uh, change out the material there. You know, started this one, refined it for that one, and then copied this design instead. Kind of. Whoops. <laughs> oh, well. That's how it goes sometimes. Um, so we need to get rid of these. Yeah, because I, I definitely like having the uh, stronger boulder middle. Is there anything else in here? Nope. At least I don't think there is. If there was still that I didn't grab it just now. That'd be weird. <laughs> All right. Uh, come, come here and just sneak, sneak in the back way. As you do sometimes. Excellent. Groovy, groovy. Now, now there's definitely contrast going on all over the place. Good stuff indeed. Good stuff indeed. Now. Another thing I've decided to grab is uh, these half slabs here, these brick half slabs. Question is, Izzy, what are you going to be doing with those? Well, that's a good question. Um, I'm not sure yet. <laughs> uh, but I'm tempted to do something like this. And then I put some uh, some fencing along the middle. So let's go uh, make some fences. Now that I remember how to do those, because I looked it up the other day. <laughs> uh, we'll uh, get some of this here. Uh, I do like the uh, the dark oak as far as this stuff, and uh, right now the, uh, the build's looking a little on the brighter side, and we don't necessarily want things to be bright and happy-go-lucky here. We want them to be a dark, spooky castle, after all, sometimes. Uh -huh. Go ahead and 
makes some of those. Plus, I'll be needing fences at, fencing at some point in the future anyway, so... Meh. Anyway. To do if we don't use it here, we'll use it somewhere else. Alright, uh, this does mean I want to get rid of that. Alright. Remember, it's all about these little details that will help you along the way. I do kind of like how it only connects to the one bit in the middle. Yes, yes. Now let's see how it looks with the other ones. Hmm. Alright, uh, it's at that level. So we're going to do that one there, that one there. And uh, it's... Right, Zondes. Very good. You don't have enough fencing with the full collection at this point. But yeah. That certainly works. Alright, now... I guess the important bit is that... Now that we got that sort of going on, we uh, we can either repeat this pattern uh, right on top of it, have a different pattern, or uh, have this pattern, different pattern, uh, and a uh, different pattern going on up, like, you know, just different uh, styles all the way. We could sort of interlace, uh, you know, interlace them, like one pattern, then the other pattern, and it all starts to build up like that. Um, I haven't quite decided yet. But I think that's going to be something we're going to be doing on a future adventure here. But at this point, um, now that I kind of got the feel of how I'm going to have the outside look, I think I'm going to be a little more comfortable with um, putting up the, the basic interior walls here. Now, the interior walls uh, are, well, they're interior walls, but they're also going to be sort of uh, canvases in their own right when we get to uh, actually building rooms and things like that, especially the main hall here. Yes. This is going to be a pretty big hall. Uh, especially on the upper levels. Is this going to be like the basement here? Yes, ground level is going to be the basement of the future castle. Hooray! Because I kind of want the, uh, the grand stairway leading up this way to be... that we, uh, already have in our little hidey hole. Uh, when it comes up here, this will be the main level of the, of the castle, which, uh, can take us all the way over there if we like. Yes, also, uh, it's kind of the top of things over on this side. We'll have other sort of lower level stuff down here. Various dungeons and the sorts. And that'll be pretty awesome, I think. I think that'd be pretty awesome. Anywho, anywho, I think, yeah, I think I have a good spot here. And uh, I got some decent resources. Uh, I'm going to need a lot more resources, though. And I'll uh, look about getting that uh, pickaxe business together. Because even just building uh, some of you know, these minor details on the exterior here took a lot of resources. So uh, to even get the basic walls up for... Uh, the main section here will be a little bit more digging, but I'm up to it. Hope you guys are up for not watching that because I don't record just me randomly strip mining. Anyway, <laughs> um, let's go uh, back to spawn, see if there's anything uh, new going on there. And uh, then we'll probably round out the episode. And we don't got our own another portal yet, we should probably go. It's another th that's the thing on my to-do list. There's been some works, uh, people setting up their bases. Yeah, Scarhoof and uh, Gepwin and... Uh, Get a tailors. Uh, Mega Bros got his uh, his hidey hole over that way. Uh, might check that out here at some point. Uh, maybe not today. I'll just probably ask, make sure things groovy on that before we uh, start doing stuff. Also, Scarhoof, uh, another one of the newer folks to the server, has uh, gone and built himself a a, a rather kick-ass uh, zombie uh, grinder situation here. Can I come down here? Go ha! Get dizzy for a while. Um, the system's been left on. Yeah, as you can come in here, zombies appear, then they zombie it up. Then you can use the, uh, zombie spawner murder ma machine. <laughs> uh, we'll let them kind of come on through. Uh, which has, uh, Smite 5, Unbreaking 3, and Sweeping Edge 3. So, uh, it's pretty effective at, uh, killing the zombies. Let's go in and, uh, wait a little moment while they sort out. This is where the babies go. Don't got a good, uh, option for them yet. Hello there, are you having, like, armor on? There we go. Hooray! <laughs> and then you get experience. Hooray! Oh, there's another one. Should've waited a second longer! It's very good at killing them. Alright, so yeah, the turn the light on, turns the light on in there. It's a water pusher thingy. Um, so this is just normal, um, murderized thing. And if we got anything we need to be putting up here, we got that. Uh, otherwise, I believe there's uh, automatic uh, systems for feeding it in. Anywho, that's that going on there. 
Let's go back upstairs. Yeah. Yeah, the, the, the whole crew here on the server is pretty awesome. Yeah, you should go check out their stuff. Uh, doo -doo -doo. And uh, there's also Captain Amazing. And I'm pretty amazing too, but to different ways. He's a whole captain at being amazing. Uh, doo -doo -doo. I think that might be a, as far as uh, newish builds around here. And of course, the Grand Viking Helmet. I need to get back to build my, my road. Anyway, the Grand Viking Helmet. Yes, of the, the banana sort. Ho ho! Also, cows. Should probably clean out that a little bit. <laughs> Lots of cows. Lots of lots of moo moos. Hmm. Yeah. Anyway, uh, I think I'll go ahead and end things here. So uh, if you enjoyed, make sure to hit the like button. I fixed the fountain, by the way. <laughs> hit the like button. Subscribe for more of this stuff and other things and uh, all that sorts of fun stuff. And of course, as always, I got a Patreon down link down below. And of course, of course, of course. Toodles. Woohoo!